Hey guys, Mortgage Mark. Let's talk about extended rate locks. Uh, before we get too far into those weeds, let's talk about just what a rate lock truly means. When you and a mortgage lender lock an interest rate, it means that's going to be your rate. That's what you close on and that rate is protected. It doesn't matter what the future market does because rates do change daily. But once you lock in that rate, the rate's set. You're good, you're protected and everything's wonderful. On normal rate locks, you can typically go out about as far as 90 days. Uh, different lenders, different programs that may or may not be true, but just as a rule of thumb, you can typically go out about 90 days and it shouldn't cost you any money. It shouldn't cost you any money up front at least. Uh, whether you pay points or something like that, that's irrelevant to what we're talking about. But for money out of pocket to lock an interest rate, it should be free, it should go out about 90 days if you want it. When you hear an interest rate on the radio, it's typically a 30 day lock. So when you hear the rate of X, it's normally for 30 days and the, the, the intervals can be as much as 15 days. So 15 day, 30 day, 45, you can lock in any duration up to that 90 day period. Now let's get to extended locks. Let's say you're maybe building a home, new construction. The house isn't going to be done for a number of months from now, but you like today's rates and you want to get protected. And that's super smart depending on the environment. I'll tell you right now uh, at the taping of this, this, of this video, Rates are, are crazy. Uh, COVID's here. It's 2021, and and obviously, you know, we just think that uh, we don't. I don't think. I just know that the the future is uncertain, right? Rates are really good, historic lows. Extended locks are very popular right now for good reason. So an extended lock allows you to lock an interest rate anywhere from four months to 12 months. And it's worth noting, most lenders don't have this program, so just keep that in mind. But for us, we can lock from anywhere from four months to 12 months. There's details below, but the premise is this, or the idea and thought is this, you will pay money upfront. There's an upfront cost and obligation for you to write a check to us to secure that lock. Now, depending on which program you pick, that upfront money may or may not be refundable. That's your choice to make. So there's programs down below where you can see like for a nine month lock, if you wanna pay money and it is refundable, then that's wonderful. You can do that. And you would think, well, what's the benefit pros and cons? Why I wouldn't want, why I wouldn't want it refundable. Well, when you lock a rate, see the easiest way to explain this. When you lock the interest rate, you're actually locking in kind of a cap, like the highest it can be an initial rate. So if today's rates are going to be X, let's say, and you decide to pay some money up front for a, a nine month lock, we'll say that upfront money, if you want it refundable, the lock, the rate you take today, Will be a little higher than if you make it non-refundable. So if you make it non-refundable, the initial lock rate will be lower. So why would you do this? Well, it's kind of using that crystal ball and, and just knowing kind of where your levels of, of risk lie. Because when you lock that rate, that's your cap. Here's the beautiful part about all this. Think of an extended, light, extended rate lock as an insurance policy. Meaning when you lock the rate today, yes, it's artificially higher, it's higher than today's rates and that's okay because you're locking it for a very long time, but you've now hit the cap. Like the rates can go no higher than that. If at the time you go to closing within 60 days, if you're within 60 days of closing and you got, you're completely done with underwriting from a credit perspective, you can go in and float down the rate to the current market rate. So if rates today stay the same for this nine month example, if they go through in nine months from now, rates are the same, you can float down to the current market at no cost. So think about that. You get the higher rate up front to just secures and, and puts a cap on what you can get. And that the market's you know less than that, uh, within 60 days of closing, you can float down for free, no cost, no obligation. So it's a really neat product, especially for folks that, you know, you're worried about what your payment may be if your rates go up. For those that may not qualify if the rates go up, uh, or just in general, folks that are worried about what rates may do in the future, right? So we're at historic lows. It's a great time to do this. So if you guys have any questions, please read the information below, but always feel free to call us. Happy to explain these in detail. And as always, we thank you for watching. Have a great day. Bye.